I'm building some furniture, never done this before, purchased a brand new home and I'm in the process of building some lanai patio furniture with some concrete uh, bricks and some 4x4s. Let's see how this turns out. I think that if I can do it, you can do it. Hi sugar cookies, I'm Cookie, your lifestyle. Welcome to my lifestyle song. <laughs> Let's get to making this buffet. Go grab yourself a little cup of coffee, waters, lemonade, whatever. Mm-hmm. No judgment here. <laughs> and let's see how this turns out in this heat, because it's hot out here in Southwest Florida. Mm. I have never taken on these kinds of DIYs before. I did the floor, that came out fabulous. Y'all saw my struggle. I'll post the video up there somewhere in the iCard so you could see how I did this, <laughs> my struggles and how I fixed it. <laughs> okay, now onto this. The reason why I already have this built is because, look, it is already getting cloudy. Mm -hmm. Again, here in Sunshine State of Florida. So, I have to hurry up because if not, I'll never get this done. Stain, stain, a little, sand this and stain it. And I am going to paint the cinder blocks. I want to share this with you. Things that I discovered leaving wood. And this is precious. These are, these are um, four by fours. The wood has gotten expensive, y'all, and wow, I was surprised by the prices, but nonetheless, the pro you know, this project right here is relatively inexpensive in context to um, what it is and the purposes that it's going to be used because we're going to have to get something custom made for this area right here. Did you see that right there? Dang, dang, I don't want to touch it. That looks like velvet. That's mold growing on the wood. Why? Even though this is pressure treated wood meant to be outside, because with all these storms and raining and raining, um, I made the mistake of leaving these straight on the, um, the uh, floor. And that's what happened. But my husband said that's okay. We can go ahead and sand that off and it won't be a problem. So that's what I'm gonna do. That's not no, that's not cute. That's very it looks like bed and steel. <laughs> not bad. Not bad. Inexpensive. And then I wanna share with you a couple of things about these quaintons right here and why I'm going to change them, why I don't recommend um these curtains. These are not curtains, the, well, they're curtains now, but these drop cloths out here, not at least in this Florida wet. Florida, don't judge me. Not in this Florida, again. <laughs> not in this Florida wet. Oh, I can't say it. Not in this weather, bye. This is not a sponsored video. This is just what I'll be using. It is semi-transparent espresso, the Minwax clear satin fast drying polyurethane i have something to mix which is this fancy gadget right here <laughs> and two separate containers one for the gel stain and one for the polyurethane two separate rags these are all cotton you might want to grab yourself a lemonade little sun sun for this hat sugar cookies the wind was picking up really bad we were expecting another storm and my husband was clowning me because I did not have the proper goggles. But I had these sunglasses and I said, you know what, let's use them. Safety first. <laughs> Fashionable. What? One can look fabulous and cool. Don't judge me. Anyway, let's do this. Okay, this is the first time I'm going to use this beauty. Oh, and it happens to be turquoise too. Did you get this for me? I no. the finger. I, I, I'll try not to. Now, what is the grade of this sandpaper right here? Oh, shoot. The husband is standing by just in case there's an emergency and not to lose a finger or break a nail, which I already did. Too late.
<laughs> Let me show you the grit. It's this right here. Check it out. Mm hmm in your local hardware store. Mm hmm and my sponsor just showing it here back. Now, let me continue going on right. Aye, right, what was that? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh yeah, that will happen. Came loose on me and it scared the daylight out of me. So what, what do you gotta do to fix it? You open up this, you sling this lever back, and then bring it over, uh -huh. and then you slide the paper in there. Okay. So when you let that lever go, it brings pressure back. Okay. Let's see, continue. It's not it's the best, the but yeah. Okay. Keep going. Okay, baby. Um, I've sanded these two blocks right here, mainly to get the yuck yucks off and just get a little bit of the surface stain on. It's not really necessary, I don't think so, because my husband said that this is porous anyway. The wind was so noisy outside. I am so sorry. I'm just showing you that I finished the sanding the 4x4s and then we're going to dismantle the rest. Stand by. <laughs> All right, all right, look at Cookie go. I can do it, yes. I'm doing it, guys. Have you tackled a project like this? And if you have, let me know how it went for you. Or would you even try tackling a project like this? Look at that. Okay, I've got those two down. <laughs> And now I got the rest to go. But look at those wood notches, how parodies. Woo! So far, this is what we've got. <laughs> Ooh, working against this humidity and this heat in Florida. Ooh, child, no. Won't be doing this again in the middle of July. What was I thinking? But anyway, these are stained and prepped and now I'm waiting to dry them up there's the other one you see that there mm -hmm. now I've got to polyurethane them good night dry up but look at these notches though isn't that beautiful love it oh, I'm so excited yay now I've got to repot that beauty over there as well. A lot going on. Mm hmm Isn't it beautiful? <laughs> Don't you worry. She's gonna come together. I promise you, it's gonna be alright. <laughs> well, before the storm, the next storm hits. Alright, gotta go. Well, good day, sugar cookies. <laughs> This is day three of working on this project. Now I'm on to building the furniture over here, the furniture. <laughs> I'm just doing this until we can get something custom built for this lanai area. This is a small lanai outdoor uh, patio space. And I think it's uh, 11 by eight or 11 by nine inches. If that and not much fits back in I've already done the floor that was my part one of my lanai series I'm getting ready to paint them I've already stained and polyurethane all of these um, four by fours here I didn't think you wanted to see me you know polyurethaning that really <laughs> so 
back onto these. So I got 16, I got 16 of these concrete bricks right here. And I got eight of these four by fours. And I'm gonna tell you what, I don't know if it's because of Rona's or what, but uh, yeah, the price of wood has escalated quite a bit. But even still, it is an economical solution well, a budget-friendly solution. I'm gonna to try to make this as aesthetically, <laughs> I'm gonna to try to make this as aesthetic as possible till I get some custom furniture here. Let's see if this works out. I'm not used to making these kinds of projects, y'all. And the reason why I'm doing this now is because we just purchased this home and um, <clears throat> it was not cheap. <laughs> it was not cheap. So this is what I'm doing till I get the furniture that I want in here now. I do have my lovely egg chair that um, that was a Mother's Day gift so that's the vibe that I'm going for okay then I've got a few things here and there like that drum I just purchased that uh, about a week or so ago from um, I'll, I'll give you details later the third and final Lanai series video is the decoration and how everything came out I was drinking hot coffee in Florida humid weather in the middle of July. <clears throat> Cookie, that's him. Don't judge me, it's just in my blood, gotta do it. Plus, this is kind of like my spinach to get doing what I gotta do back there. <laughs> my show. Let's do this. Who knew I could bend this low? Help! Get me back up! I haven't started yet and look I'm for Spitzen. Oh my gosh! Why? In July? My nuts? Oh yes, this is working out easy. Yes, easy application. That's what I'm talking about. What? Yes. That's why you need that deep nap pile on your brushes. Tell me if you said something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> awesome. This is the easy port right here. Oh yes. I'm sweating bullets over here. But nonetheless, this is very satisfying. Is my button frame? <laughs> it's a full moon tonight. <laughs> yes. Oh, this is going on easy peasy. And I'm not worried about the inside because I'm just not. This is a temporary solution. So I get what I want back here. But in the meantime, at least I'll have some cool type of seating. I'm running against another storm that's gonna roll in, supposedly by six, so I just gotta get these painted. Do you see Lizzie back there? Okay, let's see. She came back to visit me, to supervise. You see her? Uh-huh, freeloader. Run, Lizzie, run! Did I mention that it's hot and humid here in Southwest Florida in the middle of July? Almost ending, almost into August. What was I thinking? Uh-huh, disrespectful, look at that. Not one, but two biggins. Look at them lizards. Lizzie bought her husband. Look, 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 look. Uh-huh. Run! I'm done. <sighs> 16 cinder blocks in total that I've painted. I didn't bother painting the inside because the stained four by fours are gonna go through them. And this is also temporary. I just wanted something, you know, that we could sit on out here on a budget. 
<laughs> what I learned about this whole project and situation, I'm glad you asked. What I've learned, um, what I've learned is that I won't be tackling projects like this in the middle of summer in July in Southwest Florida's in the humidity. Uh, yeah, it's, it's no works. <laughs> melting, 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 melting. The next video that is coming after this one in my Lanai series is going to be the final reveal and decorating, so you won't want to miss that one. If you like this video and you think that it added some kind of value to your life, and if you're thinking about tackling a project like this, comment below and let me know and consider subscribing. I'd love for you to join my lifestyle. So, like the video and share the video. Why? Because sharing is caring. And as I say, and as I say, I was in school. And as I say, don't judge me. And as I say around these parts, smile your soul. We'll thank you for it. Really, you're not in the mood? Okay, that's okay. I got you. I got you. Be blessed, not too stressed. And guess what? I'll see you in the next. Okay, so hopefully they're done with the room, 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 room. Okay. It's nuts out here in these streets. Oh my! It's getting cloudy. I gotta hurry up. <laughs>